We are now hours away from a crucial vote by the Chicago Teachers Union. Members could decide if Chicago public schools return to remote learning. This as we await an update on COVID cases from Dr. Allison Arwady and CPS CEO Pedro Martinez. But first, CBS 2's Mugu Adigwe is live in West Town to break down the vote expected from the CTU today. Good morning, Mugu. Good morning, Ryan. So we know that students could return to remote learning as early as tomorrow if CTU members vote yes today. And the first part of that vote is expected just later this afternoon. But first, I want to detail what's slated to happen today. The House of Delegates will meet at 430 for a vote. And if they vote yes, an electronic ballot will go out to all 25,000 union members asking them the same question. And it's likely teachers will approve returning to remote learning. In fact, a CTU member tells us a teachers union poll from Sunday found that more than 80% support remote learning. If approved, students will learn from home tomorrow through the 18th or until CPS comes up with a safety agreement that teachers feel comfortable with or until COVID cases rather go down. This morning, we reached out to CPS asking what a yes vote to remote learning would mean for families come tomorrow, but we didn't get a response to that part of our question. Instead, they say they plan to keep the lines of communication open with the CTU. Just yesterday though, some CPS parents said they'd rather their kids learn remotely. And until these kids are safe, my kids will be at home on remote learning. We need N95 masks, we also, you're sending kids to school with siblings that are positive. As you mentioned earlier, Ryan, any minute now we are expecting to hear from Dr. Allison Alwardy and the CPS CEO, Pedro Martinez, talking about COVID cases and also CPS students returning to school with that surge. As soon as that happen, we'll, happens, rather, we'll bring it to you live. But for now, we're live in West Town. Digway, CBS 2 News. Now, when the union vote does take place, find out the results fast on our breaking news app. Download that free CBS Chicago app wherever you get your apps.